Hi, my name is Ali Vega. I'm the founder of Woke Weebs. We're a community organization based in Los Angeles that explores the intersections of pop culture and social issues. I'm Chloe Flores, uh, part of Sea Photography and Woke Weebs. I'm a video producer for Woke Weebs. We are here because we want to support the community in bringing um, anime films to an amazing platform like the Regal in downtown LA. This is an amazing, an event, amazing event. Congratulations on it being the second year. I love seeing anime films get this kind of exposure. So yeah, we're here to just support. And the movie, the Love, Chibuyo, and Other Delusions is supposed to be really amazing. I, I love the light novel, so I'm really looking forward to this movie right now. I'm really excited. Hi, my name is Hazuki Kato. I'm LA-based Japanese actress. I recently worked on HBO Asia, a TV show called Grise, and it's gonna come out in November. Hi, my name is Mariko Wardell. I have a show, TV show coming out next January. It's called I Am The Night, directed by Patty Jenkins. Uh, it's gonna be great. I hope y'all check it out. <laughs> um, I love anime. I'm from Japan. I'm pure Japanese. I was born and grew up in Japan. So, and especially I'm a huge fan of Jibri. So, yeah, yeah. Attack on Titan, yeah. Yeah, of course. We, we are Jibri girls. <laughs> yeah, we are Jibri yeah. girls, yes. So, right. yeah, why not coming tonight? <laughs> Hello, this is KG Tang. And Marcy Edwards. And we are voice actors here visiting the uh, Anime Film Festival. Excited to see a few of the movies. Um, there's one particularly, and for some reason I've forgotten the last word on it, and I feel awful. It's Mary and the Witches. Flower, thank you so much. I'm very interested interested in seeing that because I really like Ghibli-esque films and it's in that style so I'm really excited about that. Well I'm pretty psyched about the first one. We actually saw the uh, anime series that the movie uh, is obviously uh, from so uh, we already have some experience with uh, the franchise. Yeah so we're super psyched to see where it goes. Um, I can't even. I can't, I can't even. I can't even and I can't even. Deadly Hidden Power. Well, hello, my name is Eric Scott Kimmerer. I'm a voice actor for many popular shows such as One Punch Man, Sailor Moon, Gundam Iron Blooded Orphan, Seven Deadly Sins, Excel World, and a lot more. I'm familiar with the series, not so much the movie. I haven't watched all of the series, but I enjoyed a little bit of what I saw. It was very cute. So I am excited to see the big screen adaptation. I'm excited to see what it's all about. It seems like it's going to be a lot of fun. I am over the moon that this gets to continue because it is it's such a strong indicator that anime is here to stay that it has such a place in Hollywood and it's a part of our mainstream media nowadays and all these fans are coming out to see this so everybody needs to take note anime is not going anywhere and what are you doing tonight well geez you know what I'm thinking a lot about unlocked me too I wonder why. <laughs> Um, I'm, I'm a huge fan of anime, and even though I'm not familiar with this particular series, I hope it makes me a big fan of it and I watch the rest of it. It's just fun to jump into something new, and I love the stories coming out of Japan. They're so creative, imaginative, there's just so much great content coming from there. So it's cool to get exposed to something new and to watch it like this on the big screen. Absolutely, you know, and I mean, just to add to that, I mean, one of the things, the, the wonderful thing about anime is the storytelling, and it's just brilliant storytelling. What I love about this, is that it's bringing anime to a bigger audience. Uh, you know, a lot more of us are now able to, uh, to enjoy the wonderful storytelling that is in anime. My name is Rita McMillan. I'm the co-creator, co-director, and co-writer of Dragon Ball Z Light of Hope, which is the live action anime adaptation of the history of Trunks. I am literally everything she also just said, and I'm Donnie McMillan. Yo, what's up everybody? I'm Tyler Tackett, and I play Android 17 in Dragon Ball Z Light of Hope. Hi, I'm Ruth Ann Thompson and I play Bulma in Dragon Ball Z Light of Hope. Hi, I'm Ruben Mercado and I work makeup on Dragon Ball Z Light of Hope. I don't know if we could be any more excited. We were talking about the whole way here. KO can times 20. That's your excitement level? Yeah. Accurate. 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 Uh, Super Saiyan God Mode excited. Uh, Wait, blue or red? Blue. Purple. Purple. Fuchsia. Oh, are you going rose? It's like a hybrid version of excitement. Um, it's pretty intense, but we haven't seen this kind of a transformation before. So you have to wait and see until after I leave the movie theater. Yeah. Yeah, you can you can monitor my aura. But yes, we're very excited. Thank you guys so much for having us. My name is Stephanie Shea, and I'm a voice actress. Um, the the one that like people know me for the most is Sailor Moon, the current Sailor Moon. Okay, the, I'm like the fourth. And then if you include the Japanese, like the fifth, the fifth 
Sailor Moon. People are like, oh, you're like the original. I'm like, girl, do I look that old? No, I am the current Sailor Moon. I'm very honored to be voicing her, and I seriously respect all the ladies that voiced her in the past. So I had to Google what a chunin byo was. I didn't even know how to say it. Like, it means like chunin, you know like chunin, like is that like like a middle school? Like, and then byo is like, I think it means like sickness. So it's like a, it's like a, it's like a personality type. Although there's different subsets of personality types within that. I'm Yuki Matsuzaki, I'm an actor, also a voice actor. I was a uh, voice of Usagi Yojimbo on the 2012 uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles series. And uh, I'm on uh, lots of uh, feature films as well, live action feature films as well. There are so many anime fans out there and there are many anime film festivals. So I think it's awesome to have one and you, know, you just, you know, celebrate the all about, you know, all about anime. And I think it's a great opportunity for all of us. Hey, my name is Zach Aguilar, and I play uh, Genos in One Punch Man, Koichi in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, Colt in Hunter x Hunter, Sieg in Fate Apocrypha, and uh, the list goes on. <laughs> Three words to describe the series. So freaking awesome. <laughs> it's, uh, it's great, you know, just, just being here and seeing how big anime has really come, you know, even just the past few years, just, you know, seeing everyone here and getting to spend time with, uh, with just everyone in the industry is just amazing. I'm so, I'm so happy to be here. I'm Sandy Fox and I've been an anime voice actor for over 27 years. Some of the projects you might know me for is singing the theme song Freckles and Roroni Kenshin, the Magic Knight Ray Earth songs, um, the Tachikomas and Ghost in the Shell, Sumomo and Chobits. Um, I was Kyoko in the original Akira dub, but now uh, you might hear me as uh, Chibi Moon and Black Lady in the new Sailor Moon and Sailor Moon Crystal, Haro and Gundam Seed, um, recently uh, Male Kana and Fire Emblem Heroes, and on and on and on. But enough about me. <laughs> what I've been seeing is, especially since the, the launch of social media and the internet, that uh, anime has become more uh, widely available to audiences all over the world. And the stories have always stood on their own and the animation is so beautiful. It's just so nice to be here and support the community and see these movies on the big screen and, and see them in theaters with other people. So it's just uh, just lovely. I'm, I'm just so happy to see anime continuing to grow. Uh, hi, I'm Chris Patton. I'm associated with, uh, I play Greed in Full Metal Alchemist and I play uh, Oikawa and Haikyuu and Hajime and Ghost Stories and Cliff and Fire Emblem and uh, a whole bunch of bunch of stuff. And you? Thank you. Um, I'm Sarah Cravens and I'm Power Girl in Injustice 2 and in God of War and uh, and I'm here for a silent voice. No, we're not, but we stoked. We're definitely happy about it. Yeah, I'm, I'm curious to see what it's all about. Yeah. More anime series. Well, my favorite anime series of all time is Cowboy Bebop. My favorite film, anime film of all time is Howl's Moving Castle. Yeah. Oh man, uh, and this is gonna be super cheesy uh, because it was the first one I ever did and it's called Erased and I think it's the greatest little mystery, most fun story. Uh, and I was stoked. Hi, I'm Felice Sampler, and I'm here at the Anime Festival tonight. Um, I was nominated for Best Actress uh, for Digimon Try, the part of Mimi, and I have been so honored to play her again. I originated Mimi uh, over 15 years ago for the whole uh, series, television series, and now they're making movies, and I hope they continue as Mimi continues to grow and evolve as a human being, and I'm having a delightful time playing playing her. It's, I had no idea when I did Mimi that Digimon would be so embraced and the fans, I think, call me silly, but I feel like they have really, really embraced Mimi and I'm so grateful and I'm so happy that um, I can continue to, to be her. Thank you. This is Lex Lang and Jeff Nimoy. Hi, how's it going? I was the writer-director uh, showrunner played Tentoman for a, oh she's fangirling out on me and I play War Greymon. That's right. And then uh, I directed Naruto. I played Wolfwood and Trigun. Uh, I directed Bleach. I wrote a bunch of things. Bobo, too long to go Wonderful. into. Wonderful. This guy's a legend. Seriously. 
Uh, isn't that wonderful? I might be a legend, but Lex is one of the most, if not the most talented guy I've ever worked with. Oh my with. God, that's your too I kind. love this I guy. God. Thank you. That is really nice. Uh, it's just amazing to be here, that, uh, walking a red carpet. We rarely get to do stuff like no, this. No, this is fantastic. Yeah. More we of this in the future. Yeah, we, yes. record, we record in, you know, dark rooms with no windows, so <laughs> being out here is fun. We're alone in a padded room with just the voices in our head is basically what's <laughs> happening. <laughs> All right, bye. I guess that's it. Okay. Hey, and if you want to watch JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, you can catch me as Angelo. I'm now Rock Angelo. Also, if you're in Asia for some reason and you're watching... Uh, Dragon Ball Super, catch me as Goku. Or if you are on Netflix and you want to watch a little Rurouni Kenshin, I'm Sonosuke, so you can check that out as well. Or if you're watching Ladybug, the miraculous Ladybug, you can get me as a rocker. His name is Jagged Stone, and he rocks and rolls like nobody's business. Anyway, go to IMDb, look up Lex Lang, and you'll see another 300 or so uh, titles and that kind of thing, okay? Anyway, love you guys. Bye.